what's up y'all so uh standard tuning on this one chords you have to know are going to be a c major chord an a minor and sometimes i'll throw that um a minor seven in so i'll throw in the third fret on the e string f major and the g we're going to do it's going to be Kind of like the C chord, you just bring your middle finger up and your ring finger up one. So you have those G notes there, but you keep your index on the first on the B string. And you put back in that note on the third fret on the E. Uh, that is the, that's the way he's going to play that in the song. I don't know what it's called, but that's the way he's going to play the G. Um, then you need to know a C over B, which is just your... Put your middle finger on the A string on the second fret while you leave your index on the first on the B. And I believe that is all the chords you have to know for this one. So now for the intro, you are going to hear um, it's going to be C, A, major, a minor, F, and G. But he's going to do this little pull off thing on the first fret on the B on the B string. So with the C, glide down, glide down these strings here. Then you're gonna hit the B and the G strings together like that twice, then once with them open, and then once with them back on. Total of three times. Okay. Sorry about the water. Um, so you're gonna, that's how you start it out. So it's C, and you do the same thing with each chord, so A minor, F, and with the G, you're just gonna go to this note here, so it's gonna sound, you're gonna hit the uh, E, D, G, E string, and then E, D, G, B string. And you're gonna hit the hidden that, that note on the end there. So the verse and the intro, not the verse, the intro sounds like this. As the intro. Now the verse chords, you're gonna it's just C, A minor, F, and G, but you're gonna hold on to those longer. And when you get to the G, it's actually gonna be a little walk down that he does. I don't see many people teaching, but I'm pretty sure he does this. It's gonna go from the G to an A minor, C over B, back to the G before it goes back to the C in the verse. So I'm gonna play the verse for you real quick and how it should sound. Add some stuff in there, but you get the idea. Now, from there, it's gonna go in the chorus, and the chorus is gonna be an F major, that G chord, C, C or B, A minor, G, real fast hit there, back to F, G, A minor, and then it's F, G, and it goes back into the intro. So, let's play the chorus real quick. F, G, C, C over B, A minor, G hit real fast, back to F, G, A minor, hold on to it, F, G, back to intro. back in the second verse, same as the first, goes in the chorus again, same as that chorus I showed you, um, and then it breaks down and it's just the verse chords and the quiet part, And but when he gets to the G it just cuts out, so don't worry about planning after that, it cuts out and he just does the uh, voice a cappella, uh, and then it goes back into the 
the last chorus, and I think it starts out with just F, G, A minor, and you're gonna hear that little pull off again. And then it's F, G, and it's back to the C and it ends with the outro music. The uh, outro is the intro. It's just strung a little bit. to that song, I believe. Um, if you guys have any comments on that, if I did something wrong, let me know. I just literally just messed with it a little bit ago and haven't heard that song in a long time, but it's a good one. Um, yeah, uh, once again, that's Andrew. Hope, hopefully this helps you, man. Um, thanks for requesting stuff and for commenting all the time, man. Appreciate it. Uh, if you guys have any requests, just drop them in there and I'll get to them. And thank you guys so much for watching.